The Code Lab sessions are an opportunity to teach youngsters different programming languages. The 10 week course has proved popular as well as educational for those attending, and classes have included a number of remote speakers. Blind Group has arranged a number of speakers on a weekly basis to just give a bit of a career insight. So, what they do is we've got some software developers, we've had um, someone from Apple speak to the kids as well, we'll have another cybersecurity expert, um, systems ministry. So, we've got these different roles within the technology sector. And they've been really good to actually set up these different career talks just to give the, I, the kids just a, of a, an insight into different types of careers which, which they could potentially go into if they want to follow the, the, this, this, this route, I guess. And you mentioned how this is something that they're, they're interested in, but uh, can you tell us um, how vital you know, learning coding is in this day and age? I think it's more important than ever before, and it's no secret you know that we are getting more, and more digital as, as as things go on everything becomes digital even even our kettles and our home lights are now and now linked to the internet and nearly every most degrees these days and most careers they do need an element of coding an element of digital skills per se different levels but definitely um, coding seems to be the one program seems to be the one where there's a lot of lot of gaps in a lot of skill gaps uh, a lot of potential uh, jobs that come, coming out that no one haven't got the skills to actually fill. And in general, if you speak to, you look at the new computer science GCC that's been offered this year as well. Again, there's a lot of coding that as well. So it's more and more of a mainstream thing that needs to be taught. So these guys are getting a good, good feel of it. Bland Group CEO Nicholas Gagero says that these courses are very important and that this past year has shown how important it is to be able to work remotely. He added software industries have leapt forward during this time period, saying he's excited to help the next generation get involved in software development. When we look at the world and how it's evolved this year, um, the, the software industries have, have leapt forwards, while other industries like tourism, some of the industries I work in, have had a really tough year. So I'm really excited to try and help this next generation get involved in, in software development. Um, this is step one in that journey. We're, we're launching a pilot scheme to try and uh, get them involved. The, the bigger picture is to work with Stuart and try and get a, a digital academy here in Gibraltar, which will take what we're doing now and sort of really try and institutionalize it, not just for students, but also professionals to try and upskill them in the workplace. And the age range is quite fascinating. Yeah. Just today we've got somebody in there who is nine and up to uh, 18 years yeah. old. Um, is, it, is it important, is it vital to start them young? I think so. I think the younger the better. And, and the nine-year-old I was speaking to, she was actually the first one in this evening. She's already building a website. She's doing fantastically well. Um, and I think the, young, the younger the better. Um, she, she no doubt by the time she's 18 will be flying. Um, and part of, the, part of the reason that we're getting involved is we also want to give um, our work placements to these students. A big part of what, student, uh, what Stuart has told us is um, teaching these classes isn't enough because at the end of the class they stop. So what we want to do is make sure that the students, when they finish, have an opportunity to come into the workplace um, and put the skills they learn here in the classroom uh, into practice. And, and she'll be top of our list. At the end of the course, pupils will have acquired new skills which they can later develop. Those that excel will be given internships.